Hello friends here Dr BC and today in this video episode I am going to show you a OTG support on this Lenovo Vibe K4 Note This is my Lenovo Vibe K4 Note for our previous video on this one please click on the link flashing on the screen now in this video episode I am going to show you the OTG support on this phone now uh, to connect this phone with the OTG USB you have to use this type of OTG cable uh, there are another type of cable that is available in the market this is called as a OTG USB hub and this will also work with this Lenovo Vibe K4 Note but make sure that you doesn't buy a USB 3.0 type of cables uh, which looks like that this is a USB 3.0 micro end and this will not work with your phone so make sure that the OTG end of the cable has a micro USB port not a micro USB 3.0 port uh, now uh, to connect a OTG device to this phone you must first of all you have to plug in that OTG end in your phone and then try to insert the pen drive or the flash drive or the memory cards or the another thing that you want to connect to your phone with the help of this OTG cable uh, you can see that right now the USB storage is detecting and it is now calculating the space total space is around 28.81 GB and out of that 3.43 GB is available to use now let's see the data you can see that uh, the external storage one is detected you will find the content of this flash drive on this external storage one uh, whereas the external storage zero it is a SD card of this phone that is internal storage and that is a SD card transfer so you can see that this pen drive easily recognized with the help of this OTG cable now let's try to connect a wireless mouse insert it in that port and now let's see that whether it is working or not yeah you can see that this mouse is working uh, okay it is good uh, it is working so with the help of this OTG cable you can connect any type of flash drive data drive or pen drive even the mouse and keyboard with this Lenovo Vibe K4 not yes this phone support OTG now let's see whether this phone uh, support a 2 terabyte of this hard disk with this OTG and now let's see that connecting the hard disk and you can see that the phone has the capability that it will turn on this hard disk uh, you can see that this Seagate backup plus has detected and you can see that this Seagate backup plus 2 terabyte is mounted and tap total commander to open that and you can see now the content of this hard disk now let's see whether it is mounted in a rewritable form now let's try to uh, make a folder that is name as PCD tech and you can see that the BCD tech is created so you can see that this 2 terabyte hard disk is now detected by this Lenovo Vibe K4 Note it is not detected by the inbuilt or mount manager you have to uh, use this Paragon UMS mounter for NTFS file system and also use the total commander file manager to open the mounted partition in this Lenovo Vibe K4 Notes so with the help of this Paragon UMS you will mount a NTFS partition with this Lenovo Vibe K4 Note there is no problem all thing works perfectly now let's unplug that and now finally let's check that whether this phone support USB hub or not uh, this is my uh, USB hub for our previous video on this unboxing and review of this USB hub please see on the link flashing on the screen now let's see whether multiple devices can be connected with this phone at a same time yeah uh, now also connect this one that is that hard disk yeah uh, you can see that all are detected and first let's see whether yeah the mouse is working and you can see that the Seagate drive is detected and now let's try to play some music you can see that the thing is working yeah the thing is working and now go back and now let's see 
this one yeah you can see that you i can directly use this hard disk with this lenovo wipe k4 node there is no problem while mounting and using this hard disk with the help of this hub end now let's quit that and also unmount this now now let's see cancel and now let's see the file browser and you will not find this type of mounting that is this seagate one in the file manager uh, you will all and now let's i quit that quit that cancel and now let's see in the setting whether i got that one uh, if you see the storage here you can see that the sd card is detected and also the external usb that is this one that is verbatim 32 gb is detected with the help of this otg and but the not the secret one now let's try to mount this secret one this with this help of this mount manager and if you see it is mounted so uh, the ntfs system files will be shown only by this total commander and with the help of this paramount ums else fat formatted partitions can be directly seen on the file manager of this lenovo wipe k4 node and also you can connect the mouse with this lenovo wipe k4 node with the help of this usb hub so you can see that this phone support otg and also otg hub to connect various devices at the same time with this lenovo wipe k4 node now this completed the otg support video on this lenovo wipe k4 note if you like this video give a thumbs up share and subscribe the subscription link shown on your screen and for more videos on such type of information gadget technology and many more keep watching bcd tech thank you and have a nice day bye bye